we're two crafty sheilas i'm bell i've got Loz on the line with me we're going to do some unboxings today and i've been having a few connection issues so i am now recording outside on my back veranda so apologies if you get some ambient noise of the wildlife or if any mole would start up i'm really sorry i can't control that <laughs> or if any screaming happens it means she's got a snake <laughs> yeah I'm hoping not because I'm up on the second floor, like I'm on the upstairs deck. So if there is a snake up here, like I'm, I'm out. Like <laughs> the house is going down, and it's just not going to cease to exist. Okay. <laughs> um, watch our weapon cut yep. video from that we recorded earlier this morning that I'm actually going to put up today, but this video will probably go out in, in the next few days. Um, we talked about the fact that I actually had a snake in our backyard yesterday, which our dog took out. Amazing. <laughs> so, night season's already started, apparently. Brilliant. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. Sorry if you heard my cat sneezing. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm living the dream with animals today. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get this video going. Um, so today, it's an unboxing video, in case you couldn't guess. Um, it's a Diamond Art Club. It was one of the ones that I did get from Black Friday last year. I promise, I this is my second last one from Black Friday. I am almost done just in time for the new Black Friday class. Exactly. So this is the absolutely gorgeous Penguin Harmony by oh. Steve Sandstrom. Sundrum, sorry. That's it's a square. I don't know if you noticed, it's a 94 by 70. So this is a bit of a worker um, and it was quite heavy. So that's why the box also got put back down. So for anyone who hasn't been getting any Diamond Art Clubs and don't know anything about it, just to let you know, they have updated their packaging now. As of this year, they've they've changed how they're packaging. But in the old boxes, you've got a square here to tell you that they're square diamonds. It's also blue. Yeah, it does look blue in the camera. That's good. Um, yeah. Whereas the rounds are more of a pink and they've actually got a circle on there. Um, so... You've got square written on the side, all the information about how to diamond paint and what your kit includes, um, a QR code in case you want to get a discount. But look, honestly, there are discounts everywhere for Diamond Art Club. Don't ever, 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 ever pay full price. Oh, um, the back neighbour's got their digger out. Sorry, guys, hopefully it's not too loud for you. Oh. <laughs> Now we just need your friendly magpie to come back and have a chat. <laughs> He's around. I've been watching him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. When I put my sticker sheet back in, I've accidentally mangled it a little bit. So that's me. It was fine when I got it out. I'm going to flatten it down. So please don't judge Diamond Art Club on this one. <laughs> okay, I'm going to show you how bad it is. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> It, the the box got knocked and kicked around a little bit. So, um, this is a sticker sheet which can go in your ledge in your logbook. Um, you can pop in your start and your end date. It's got a lovely, lovely bigger image of what we're going to be doing. How oh, gorgeous is that? Those diamonds are going to be incredible colours. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can't even tell. There are two ABs because it's under 150, so it's just 111 and 141. But there are three fairy dust drills. Oh. out of six two colors so i think this will be quite nice i just love and i love the fact that i can say genuinely this is the aurora australis penguins are southern hemisphere animals so yes. this is aurora australis time. <laughs> i have to be honest that's part of the reason i bought it was because it was aurora australis, australis. <laughs> love i love it them. that's great <laughs> um so then you've also got a nice little logbook sticker of the same thing so it's just a really really good size um look people put it on the end of the boxes depending on how you store your boxes if you're not doing it straight away i put it in my logbook um other people i've seen are really really crafty and make cover minders out of them good on them i have no idea how they've got the time or the patience but that is yeah. awesome when they do it so yeah. points to them all right toolkit so again, this is one of the older toolkits, but by far one of my favourite toolkits because you get all the yeah. lovely I agree with yeah. that. Um, so bag of baggies. Look, they, they started to get a little bit cheap on their baggies. I'm not complaining. I don't need heaps of them, so that's fine. Uh, washi tape. That's pretty. Oh, that's cute. I like that. Ooh, I like that. Sorry, don't ask me what flowers. I don't know flowers. <gasps> that's a dream. Oh, look at that. All right, so this is a cover minor for anyone who doesn't know. So there's a little magnet on the back 
as well as a, a free magnet that's attached. Um, what you end up doing is on your canvas, you can cut back some of the plastic for the section you want to work on. You just peel that plastic back and then you pop that on the front side of that bit of plastic and that underneath your canvas and it holds your plastic back so you can work on that area. That is so cute. Um, we've got, oh, because it's a square, we get our Diamond Art Club branded tweezers and these are the pointy kind. Um, they're nice ones too. I do like these tweezers. We've got our heart-shaped wax. So you do get two little plates of it in a little heart caddy. Don't forget that these plates do have plastic on the front and the back, so make sure you remove both pieces before you try and load your pen if you decide you're going to use the, the wax. We get a little glitter pen with a matching squishy. Oh, that was super easy. Oh, no worry. Struggle straight. <laughs> See, it's because we're coming into warmer months. Must be. Must be. Must be. Yeah, but let's say. Yeah. <laughs> I just watched that magpie fly by. Oh, it's found something to eat. All right. Yeah. Um, <laughs> it's going a bit further, but it's obviously found something to eat. Oh, yeah. um, you also get two multi places in there, so you get a little four placer and a seven placer. So if you want to place more than one drill at a time, you can pop one of these in, just load it up with your wax or your putty, and away you go. All right, there's that. And, of course, we get our tray with a stopper. Now, these trays are really, really sturdy trays. I quite like these trays, actually. Um, and you can pop your little stopper on the end. So, officially, I think that's the direction it's supposed to go. It's not the way I go. I usually put the pointy uppy bit on the inside. I just find it sits a little bit better. Um, but whatever works for you. There is no right and wrong way to do this craft, guys. Just whatever makes your heart happy. All right, let's have a look at the Whopper. Okay, so we've got a branded dust cover bag. Did you hear that? Oh, that was a massive thud. <laughs> <laughs> That's your new snake whacker. <laughs> I'm not going to damage one of my beautiful, beautiful canvases on a snake, thank you very much. And we don't condone hitting wildlife. I was no, that's joking, right. guys. That's right. That's right. We would never. All right. Oh, my gosh. You're not even going to get all of this in the view. Okay. I'm just going to start with the oh bottom. and I'll move it. Look at oh. that confetti. Oh. oh I'm, I'm having heart heart palpitation. <laughs> I'm, I'm not coping. I'm not coping. <laughs> Chicken. All right, let's just have a quick look at the canvas and then I might roll it back so that we can flatten it down. Look, it will flatten on its own, but just for the sake of recording, I'm going to help it along a little bit more. So moving up, look at oh. that. Just the detail. That is spectacular. So you can see while we're here, we've got a legend on this side, which goes two-thirds of the way down the image. Awesome. <laughs> Down the bottom here, we've got a little thumbnail as well as all the licensing details. So this is licensed artwork from Steve Sundrum, um, licensed with Diamond Art Club. So it does mean that the, the artist has been compensated for their piece, which I think is always preferable. All right. Sorry, guys. Hope no one gets sick, sick with this. Okay. <laughs> we've got all this beautiful imagery. Oh, my God. We've got the little penguin family at the up here. How gorgeous is that? Um, with the Have diamond you seen up basil. Sorry, I'm changing the subject. You know how no. there's like a new emperor penguin down baby down in Melbourne Aquarium, and he's named oh. Basil. Oh no, Basil Pesto. Pesto. And, Close okay. enough. Basil yeah. Pesto. And he's like the the biggest <laughs> baby in history. Apparently, he's huge. Oh, Never so mind him, Pesto. <laughs> An emperor. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'll have to go and have a look. That's so cute. <laughs> All right, and then over this side, over the last bit of the image, look at all those beautiful reds in the Aurora Australis. That is beautiful. Show me the drill field for its feathers. That okay. looks intense. Well, it's section the line blocking, so that's just the bottom last bit of the thing. Um, we do have, sorry, I'll just do this bit. Um, we've got our... Um, socials down here. We've also got our lifetime warranty if you are the original purchaser of the canvas. And yes, that's second second legend. Okay. Come up. Oh, okay. That's not too bad. Yeah. <laughs> lots of lots of little lines. It's yeah. it's not as bad as you think, but it is still gonna be a fair bit of confetti. 
Oh, and like even in the water. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So it's it it looks bad. It's not as bad as you think it is. No. That's incredible. Lovely. Love Actually, that's flattened in the time it's taken me to go around. So that's nice. Okay. So what else we get in there is a little thank you leaflet and a little note from the owner. Uh, what's included in your kit, step by step how, uh, step by step instructions, and a video if you need to watch it. Once you've made your first purchase, you can uh, join the Facebook group, the VIP group. Little tips and tricks. There's another code. And if you download the app for iPhone or Android, you get a discount for your first purchase through the app as well. All right. There's the drills. <laughs> oh. so big. At least it's in one bag. Yeah. That's a plus. <laughs> it's one bag. Okay. So if you keep your drills separate, it does have a sticker on there so that you can always find it. So this will work for you, Loz. Yeah. Look at the colors. Oh, it's incredible. I love it. That is so beautiful. And happy. It is. It is. I have been hanging out to unbox this one. I haven't seen many people unbox it or do it. I don't know. No. I don't know. Um, I just I was so drawn to these colours. It was like I was umming and iron which kits to buy for Black Friday. This one was never in any doubt. It's I just love it. Yeah. All right. I love how we both have different styles. So I get to see something that's completely different that I wouldn't buy, and I'm yes. loving it. It's amazing. So do I. So do I. Yeah. I. I find that we're going to have a lot more variation for people to find something that works for them or yeah. see something that they wouldn't have necessarily thought that they would like and then fall in love with it. Because I don't know how many times I've watched you do an unboxing and go, it's not really my style. Oh, I could do that one after watching that's you do right. it. So, that's exactly yeah, it's, right. It's really good. I love this. Yeah. All right. Let's start with the big chunky bags. I'll quickly go through the colours. So we got some beautiful purples. We're just going to have like all the colours of the rainbow here. Yeah. We got two bags of the 807. Oh, I love that colour. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to bump the camera. Um, two bags of the 775. We've got some of our greys and our top colours coming through. Look at that pink. Oh, pink. Two bags of the four five three. We got two bags of three eight four six. I love this blue. I think it's just beautiful blue. We got eight oh nine. We got two bags of four one three. And there's a thirty three seventy one. It actually looks like that's the only thirty three seventy one. Oh no. Nice. All right. What are we looking for? Two ABs, three fairy dust. Okay. Right. Oh. Sorry, train fell on the ground. Okay. First AB. Now, there is three oh. bags. Here. Three? No way. Oh, yeah. All right. So AB stands for Aurora Borealis. And you know what, Loz? I don't feel like I have to call it the AA in this one because I've got an AA kit. So yeah, you do. Yeah, we'll call it AB. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll let you. Yeah, that can that can fly today. <laughs> thanks, thanks for the permission, Lars. Thanks. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> um, so Aurora Borealis. So these drills, they have that little extra coating on the top, so you can see that it sort of becomes a little bit more, um, you know, colours of the rainbow, a little bit more reflective, a little changes how it appears. Um, they're extra shiny, they're extra bright, and they'll often pick up some of the colours of the, the drills around them as well. You can see, I know it looks like there's a blue drill in it. That's actually the reflective bit on the back of one of the drills. So that one's clearly going to be a oh, trash yeah. drill. Uh, but it does give you that demonstration of just what that coating does. <laughs> it's perfect. <laughs> Sorry, three of those. <laughs> and then blues. Two bags of this 452. Getting into some more of the purples again. Oh, fairy dust. So anything with a Z for Diamond Art Club is the fairy dust drill. Um, now with this one, it's got a little bit of a glitter coating on it as opposed to that really shiny reflective coating of the AB. So it's a lot more subtle. I don't know if I'm really picking it up fantastically well. Apologies. Outside, it's a bit more glary. There's a little bit there. Yeah, you can't see too much, but you can get little bits of it. 
yeah yeah so it's just a little bit more subtle it's still going to pick up a lot of the shine and things but just not quite as obvious so i quite like it oh there's your yellow oh my favorite two bags of the 827 oh there's another fairy dust oh that's pretty that's a gorgeous color isn't it yeah that one you might see the tops a little bit more clearly than the other one no not really yeah. sit at the back uh, yeah it's a, definitely a little bit more subtle oh three bags of three eight four three i love this color too yeah that's beautiful and there's that lovely one one of the zeds ones no okay. oh i think that might have been one of the zeds but it wasn't oh, oh and only one bag of three ten i can handle that that's not too oh, bad awesome. so three ten oh, is the black another train <laughs> No, no, these no. are the big bags. This is done, yeah. We're getting into small bags now. Cool. So, yay, just the one bag of 310. <laughs> <laughs> um, and it's not too full, but I can see, like you can see, that there doesn't appear to be heaps of have static in there. Um, I'm just having a look to see if there's any obvious crash drills because if it's going to be in any, it's going to be more likely to be your blacks and browns because they're printed more regularly. But it actually looks pretty good. Nice flat bottoms. Oh, that we've got a white straggler in there, but I can live with that. Oh, it looks pretty good, actually. Okay. All right, let's go on to the next train. I think this is the second, maybe third last train. We're going to go back the other way. All right, so you got purples, that purple brown color, more purples, grays, talk, our third and final fairy dust. See so yellow. Oh, they're gorgeous. That's a really pretty pale one. That actually seems to show the glitter covering a little bit better. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. That's cool. Okay. All right, more purple, oranges, just in time for spooky season. <laughs> Got this lovely purple. Oh, I like that green. That's a beautiful green. Oh, nice. Oh, that that. Um, that'll probably be in the Aurora, I'm guessing. Yeah. And the reflection of the yeah, aurora. Yeah. Two bags of seven four one. A lovely greeny colour there. Another bright yellow for your laws. And just mixed up, we'll go back the other way again. Okay. And there's our second and final A B and our last special drill to go through. Oh, oh wow, you can see that reflection. <laughs> yeah <laughs> that's pretty i like that it's a it's sort of not showing up too well in the camera but it's it's very much like a fuchsia color it's a really yeah, pinky purpley red mm. yeah it looks more pink in the camera doesn't it mm. beautiful some darker blues beautiful green color browns dark browns Lovely blues. Oh, I love these. More greys, browns. I need a little bag of 938. Not bad. Bright orange for your laws. Oh, that's pretty. Lovely blues. And that's the end of the colours. Oh, and the 6,000s. There's one, two 6,000s. So 6,000s are dmc codes but they're ones that diamond art club have created themselves um so you basically won't get them anywhere else at this point in time um they may end up selling the color formulation i don't know but for now that's all you get so they're pretty cool so they're just a little bit different to the other shades that are available regularly okay so let's very very quickly have a look at where the special drills go so that first one was that fuchsia ab um, it is the symbol number one. Now I can see it just in little tiny little dots and patches um, just all through here. So anywhere where you're seeing those little patches of pink, they're going to be your, your um, pink AB. Um, same with just all through the bottom here. Um, and all through the bottom here, a little patch at the bottom of here. So it's just going to be, I'm assuming, where that aurora is reflecting off the 
off the ice, you know, down the bottom, patches again. It's just sprinkled all the way across. But interestingly, not. not in the Aurora itself. Really? Yep. Ooh. Nothing, nothing in the sky. Everything is reflections of the ice on the ground. Okay. Trust the process. <laughs> I like it though, because it kind of makes sense. If it's ice, it probably is going to reflect a little bit more. Brighter, yeah. yeah. Hmm. Good work. Good work. Even yeah, the artist picking that up. Hey. What? Yeah. Um, the next one is the white. Now, it's the usual white background with a black dot. Um, it's the one for one. It's stock standard in almost every Diamond Art Club kit, let's be honest, because it is so versatile. It works really, really well. Look, it's everywhere. <laughs> Anywhere where you're seeing that white, that's your white AB. So there's just lines and patches of it all through this entire kit, you know, even down to around the edges of each of the penguins it's going to be the white a b uh, the yeah the white a b got patches of it all through here at the tops and on some of the bellies of some of the emperor penguins um a little bit up the top here off the um mountain again nothing in the sky over there it's just all reflection again kind of makes sense now that i've thought about it Okay, let's just fold you down a little bit so I can move it down. Go down. Um, you can see a big patch of it here on the belly, all around the top and the beaks of these penguins down here, surrounding that entire little baby. So cute. <laughs> Patches it around the eye, around the outline of that penguin. Um, all across the top of the mountain over here. Oh, my gosh, this thing is so big. Okay. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Trying to bend the canvas. <laughs> and look at all of it in the moon. Oh, nice. That will be nice. I'm looking forward to that. But that is a whole heap of white AB outline. All right, so the next specials were the three fairy dust. Um, okay, so I'll put all those ones back out, if I can find them. Oh, okay, just because I found it first. That really, really pale yellow, the 3823. Oh, it's the equal sign. Okay, now I did see some of that. It's outlining this top little penguin up here. So oh, probably because yeah. it's in the background a little bit more, I'm assuming, it probably doesn't reflect quite as much. And a little bit sort of through down on the snow underneath it. Um, where else have we got it? There's not, there's not heaps of that. I would have thought there would have been more from the size of that bag. Exactly. Maybe they're scattered. They might be scattered around a bit more. I think you're probably right. All right. Yeah, there's little bits of it in the little baby penguin. There's little patches of it sort of through, sprinkled throughout. And same with big mama or papa bear penguin. It's sort of scattered up through the flipper. Yeah. Is it flipper? Yeah. Um, yeah, tons of it. A little bit sort of down on the, the bottom section of this big mama or papa penguin. Yeah, not tons. Nice. But, yeah, it looks like it's going to be a little bit more subtle. Oh, yeah, I can see little patches of it on the ground there too. Yeah, through there, through there, through there. Yeah. Um, next AB I can find. Not AB. Cherry dust. All right. Next one, next tab off the rank is that beautiful green one. 
Well, it's the hash symbol. Okay, let's see if I can find the hash symbol. That's got to be in the Aurora. Yeah, it is. Oh, that's nice. And also the reflection. Yeah. Um, oh my gosh. Hang on. I'm just going to fold this in half so I can actually get to it. <laughs> okay. So, lots of sections, just again, patches, but sections through here. Um, so that reflecting bit down there and on the side, that's really nice. Um, but the bit that you're looking for, a little bit up here, and there's a massive chunk of it here. Oh, wow. Massive chunk of it over this side and a bit more up here. Yeah, perfect. Perfect um, colour. Definitely. And then even over the other sides, other way laptop okay um yeah chunk of it here chunk of it through here chunk of it through here uh, small chunk of it in here so there is a little bit throughout yeah um, that looks good and then oh, the last one is this one the pinky one which is the black symbol. All right, so I'm going to assume it's probably going to be near the uh, pink AB would be my guess. Yes, yeah, so there's a little bit sort of underneath the white AB here, reflecting the aurora. Oh, well, that'd be cool. The aurora wireless, because I can get away with saying it. <laughs> Yeah, patches of it sort of down here on the ground, and it is getting close to those pink ABs. Yeah. That was my laptop, sorry. <laughs> I thought it was the box. <laughs> nope, laptop. <laughs> um, okay, little patches of it all along the bottom. Yeah, it's sort of going to be just patched throughout this whole thing um definitely a fair bit in this lower one you can see it's a lot more of the reds and pinks and things so there's just patches of it through this entire penguin that is going to be beautiful and same with itty bitty bubba penguin here a fair chunk of it is just going to have patches all through its belly yeah you too yeah Wow, Aww. it's beautiful. I can't wait to do Why this. Why did you unbox this one? Because I, I swear, I don't think I've seen another one unboxed, like you said, all worked on. So yeah. it's nice to see something a bit different. Yeah, well, that's, I don't know why. I, I seem to grab the ones that probably don't get unboxed as, as often. So maybe I've just got a weird style. Um, I don't know. Yeah. I'll, I'll <laughs> agree. Yeah. You're doing that. Yeah, thanks, Mom. Thanks for support. Love you too. <laughs> Very yeah. good. All right. Well, tell me, have you got this one in your stash? Is it something that's interesting to you? Is it something that you would want to buy? Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. Um, or am I just weird? That's, I'm fine with that too. You can, you can tell me that in the comments below. I don't have an issue. Um, well, you but tell me. <laughs> yeah. I'm, Look, we got to be us. We're not, we're not going to be derivative. We're not going to be, you know, same old, same old. We're just us. We're us. That's right. That's why you all love us. All 100 of you. We, we live in <laughs> Queensland, so we are who we are. Sorry, guys. <laughs> oh, dear. Um, but yeah, tell us in the description if you've if you've done this, if you've seen it, if you want it. Um, I'm actually not sure if it's in stock or not at the moment. I didn't look before I started recording this, um, but I'll put a note in it in the description with the link and let you know whether it's in stock or not. Um, but otherwise, don't forget to give us a like if you like how I unbox these crazy videos and if you like the fact that I'm outside and you can hear all the ambient noise that goes on in my neighbourhood. Um, <laughs> otherwise, have a really, really good day, guys, and we'll see you in a video very soon. Bye. See you later.